The Matthew C. Perry High School basketball teams took the court for a different type of practice last week. Uh, today we're just doing a scrimmage against the high school. We're building camaraderie. You know what I'm saying? It's basically to show them where they're at on a skill level because, you know, like a lot of them want to go to college after this, you know, so we're trying to give them more of a real feel of college, how, how big the dudes would be. And it, it's just to really put a positive image in the head because they got a tournament this weekend, so get them as pumped up as they, we can for that tournament. In addition to preparing them for the tournament, the basketball teams learned about working together to play more advanced athletes. They give us that mentality that they're bigger than us, so I don't, we just build confidence in team chemistry. I played back in the States, I had 6'9 guy, I had to guard. I'm only 5'10, so it's a foot difference. So it's, it's tough, but you just have to build over that and play with your heart. The students did benefit from the competition, and Marines used the practice to provide a good example to the younger generation. So this right here is just me getting back to high school kids. I usually see around base, because if they see us doing positive, they'll do the same thing, you know? So this right here is just a, another positive feedback to the kids. Everybody wants that person that they can look up to, so we never know who on the court they actually look up to. So me playing basketball, although it's just me, you know, dribbling the ball, shooting some basket, to them it could be, hey, that's the dude that I want to look out, you know, look after, and be like, hey, I want to be like him when I grow up. So you, you never know where, where, you know, you'll be a role model. Overall, the Marines who participated were able to provide a highly competitive playing environment while setting the example. Reporting from Marine Corps Air Station Iwakuni, Japan, I'm Marine Corporal David Bickle.